you've started your company several years back. In terms of being a, a partner and a co-founder for the agency, I, I feel that this space for communication agency um, are typically not managed by women. In your own space, how do you feel um, or share any obstacles uh, as women facing in this industry? Um, yes, when I entered a business um, or this type of business, creative industry, I realized that there were fewer women, but as time progressed, I realized that, um, you know, in fact, uh, there are women too. Uh, it's just that we usually take the back seat. Mm. Um, and I think there's a new data that shows um, in Cambodia, uh, so many SMEs, uh, small and medium enterprises are actually owned or managed by women. And um, I had an opportunity to work with um, a UN agency to train um, a lot of SMEs, like nearly 100 SMEs. And I found that, that, I, that those are actually managed and co-founded by women. For myself to um, you know, manage the business, a co-managed business in this industry, there have been quite a number of uh, challenges. Uh, but of course, I think those challenges are also shared by um, my male counterparts as well. Um, but of course, the, the lack of um, uh, encouragement to, to push uh, women to the front um, mm -hmm. actually comes from a more like a cultural um, a factor. So of course, there are women managing businesses here in Cambodia on a day-to-day -day basis, except that, like I mentioned earlier, they like to take the back seat, you know, they, but in fact, they do a lot of operations and management as much as men do.